to Martin. Didn't go for the long goal this time. Had a better offer, and it was J Mark. Got lucky there, Steph Martin, because Matty Cruiser followed up his own work beautifully, ran after it, and Steph Martin was just daydreaming a little bit, just shifted out the back. But occasionally, you end up with the footy, and what you have to do then is finish it okay, and his kick was good. They've gone for a tall forward setup. Jamar having a go up there. Spencer's been up there. Johnson's kicked a monster goal. Jamar should kick this from 40. It's not great off the boot, but it'll head it in the right direction and scores a <laughs> Sylvia kicks towards full forward. Good mark. Hands out in front. Brick. What can he muster from 45? Laid up forward for the game. That's a better hit. And has it got the carry? It has. He's kicked two. What's that for? Little grab on the right arm. Well, he started off with one of the uglier goals of the season. His second, though, indicated he might be getting a taste for it. And now he has his most challenging shot. He'll be kicking from just inside 50. And the angle around 45 degrees. He's never kicked three in a match. Not until today anyway. That's a beauty. All clear. Is the secret. Yeah, it's Melbourne's ball. It was their free kick. Sylvia comes away. Sets up Jarrah here now. Will he get a bounce? And is he quick enough? Bangs it long to a one-on-one. -on -one. Johnson from behind Thornton. Ajayma rather recovered well and hangs it over the post, but it's inside. And Mark Jayma and the kick from Jared just didn't have enough on it to get over the head of Thornton. But what a pick up and what a kick on the outside of the left boot. Bait slicing it in towards half forward. It fell for Martin. He is a left footer. Oh, he just took a bit too long. Jarrah need to be clever. Did okay. Mackenzie awkward bounce to two big men. Jay